Saludos a todos and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Grinch. I am Jalisco, your host, and on the last episode we we did the um, post office of the Ho of Whoville, and on this episode we do have some stuff to do. We are going to continue on with the missions for this area. Uh, first and foremost, we want to change into our disguise. Because as we all know, who's are stupid and think a cloak, a uh, completely cloaked man with a stupid um, expressionless uh, mask, plastic mask, and green hairy feet and hand hands is normal. <laughs> Anyways, first things first, let's climb over here and get over here get some eggs on our way there <laughs> well great commentary get here get that over there anyways we have to swing over these poles we can do that if we don't have the cloak this guy is going to confront us well not really confront us but fight back what you want to do is butt slam that there and presto we have some paint now what's that on our to-do list that needed paint all right we have to paint all the mayor's posters here's one for example Take this. and we have to do that to all of the posters also hit our heads multiple times Mm, up there it's a 10 gift I believe so let's go get at the uh, since we're no let's get that later there's something I do want to do and mm, in my practice uh, non recording session was actually easy get that over there now in here let's see how the let's play curse affects me Nope, Chuck Testa. Nope, Chuck Testa. Okay. Mm. Oh, dang it! It was so easy. Oh my God! Oh, sorry. Mm. Uh, it's harder than it looks. Nope, that's wrong. Uh, okay, one more, one more. We can do this. Well, I can do it. Ah. Uh. Oh my god! Also, I don't know. I'm pretty sure you can hear it, but oh, but there's a laughter in the background music that always like oh yes, <laughs> two for one. Well, the laughter actually uh, it kind of creeps me out. And yes, right there on screen appeared that we have all the blueprint parts for the egg launcher, the rotten egg launcher. <laughs> so <sighs> I guess I'll meet you back at the Grinch cave to complete the rotten egg launcher. So, I'll meet you there. Be right back. Oh, wait. Poster. <laughs> That's number four. Um, is there another poster in my way? Yes, there is. So, well, I suppose I'll walk you there. <laughs> I'll kind of like that expression they did there. Oh. <laughs> Now the very the last posters and um, snowmen and the last everything in general of these missions actually give me the most problem, the the most trouble because, well, it's the last one. Where it is? Where is it? You've been all over the place. Well, anyways, it puts puts us directly at our drone and egg launcher blueprint, and we only have to rotate this. Oh. And presto, we have the first and my favorite weapon in the game, actually. The rise. 
rotten egg launcher's a brilliant invention, as the smell that it brings causes more than just tension. Once an eggshell breaks open and vile fumes escape, who eyes glaze over and who mouths can only gape? When the Grinch needs to hassle the Who's from afar, he turns to his launcher with a hearty har-har. Few things irk him more than Who's equipped to resist the days and confusion brought on by rottenness. Yep. Okay, we have the egg launcher. Um, with the first person view, we, well, pretty much, shoot with, um, what? Oh, with circle, we shoot with circle, move, remember your, um, Y, Y, your Y axis is inversed, so, yeah, with L1, yeah, with L, press L1 you can change between your gadgets, quick press, and it unequips the thing. So, I'll meet, well, now let's go to Hubil again, and continue on with our things. Now, the glitch that I told you about, the bad breath, it also worked with these, um, with the egg, with the egg launcher. Yeah, I don't really know how to activate it again. Yeah, I, I, I wish I, I knew how. Anyways, with the rotten egg launcher, now we can shoot the um, those windows up there, up there that open and close, and to complete another mission. But for for now, I'm looking for snowman to splatter like that. Yeah, Grinch. And every time you complete a mission, the Grinch does the Grinch celebration. Right? Why not? Okay, now we have all the um. Uh, what's the what you call it? The snowman. We don't really need these these guys anymore since oh, it's mostly for s the security, well, self security, <laughs> not anything. Uh, but I'm going to hold hold on to it for um for a while because I'm still looking for posters and you know kids and policemen and everything. Uh, I think there no, there's no poster here. Oh, there's one there. Haha. <laughs> now this area is pretty small, mind you, and it's kind of hard to miss things and get lost. But you will. Well, you. Yeah, I, I, I really do. I, I, I've already lost my track of the um, posters. So let's. Oh, um, the missions. 8 out of 10. Well, okay, I suppose I can save the rest for later. For now, let's take out, take off this silly costume. And uh, there. And start shooting stuff. <laughs> oh, wait. Another poster here? Wow. <laughs> I completely forgot there was down there. Uh, okay. Um. Um, okay. He's scared of the Grinch and his bad breath. Yeah, the bad breath. You can also do this with the rotten eggs, and it's faster and safer. But if you breath on a who, a, a innocent what? An innocent who? It gives you a present. What? 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 Oh! Okay, some kids will attack you, like that little bastard there. Oh. Yeah, that one. Haha, -ha, gotcha, didn't I? Okay, let's shoot. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that present was actually the last one I got in my first playthrough of this game because I w didn't know I could shoot that man. Ooh, last poster. 
What? No, the music protects him. There we go. Ow. Last. And they're grinched. <laughs> Yeah, great. Yep, they indeed are. Mm, so we can continue on. Uh, what? Oh! And right. the Grinch got to thinking how nice it would be to get some fresh air, watch the Who's try and ski. And now we have the Who Forest unlocked. I really don't like that place. Oh my goodness! I really, really don't like the Who Forest. It's. I think it's my. No, my. One of my two least favorite ones. Okay, so. One other thing we have to do is to move that clock up there. The. Mm, no, wait. No, that's not the clock. Uh, never mind that. We have. This also took me a while to figure out. What? Ah, there we go. Yeah, uh, no people, but a lot of screaming. For some reason, it didn't occur to me that I could shoot the clock to make it eight. If you read the sign on the side, it tells you that the hall, the this place opens at eight o'clock. So there's nothing much we can do here for now. We actually have to go to the the Who Forest first, but we can come here and uh, some of these this one some of these are retractable and yeah. ooh, another blueprint for the binoculars you can easily tell which ones you can pull because they're taller than the other ones and they actually glitch a little out of the wall but you can't never be too cautious like that over there if it's a binoculars one, please... Yeah, yeah. Yes! We got all the binoculars parts as well. Now, up this upstairs, there's not really any points going there right now. It's really, it's important for this mission, but um, not right now. We don't have the stuff to complete that mission. But for now, yeah, I'm going to leave the shooting of the um, houses for... What was that? Oh right, my <laughs> videos finished processing. Um, uh, I well, just for the shit and giggles, let's shoot that one. Over. There. Yeah. It's gonna smell like Santa's ew socks. Yeah, Santa sucks. Apparently, sucks. Well, I could shoot this one over. That's the clock over there. That clock. That's the one we have to move. And right now, we don't have the stuff we need. S yet. So, let's go back to the Grinch cave. It's not this way, is it? No. Oh, goody, policeman. Well, this is what happens when you sting a policeman. Oh, come on. Nothing happens, I didn't hear. Yeah, he just gets kind of annoyed at you. You can also break presents with the uh, rotten, rotten, rotten egg launcher, but not the ones that are reinforced presents. Yeah, you can break the blue greenish ones and the red ones with the rotten egg launcher. Now the binoculars. Um, this goes here, this was here, turn that around, yeah. The little G thingy, like, with the, inform the data thing square on the lower right, it's always on the lower right. Took me, like, 15 minutes to actually realize that on my first time doing Binoculars this. Binoculars help the green mean one peer closer at a who family, who teacher, who postman, who grocer. 
as well as a better look, he has improved aim. He hits targets more often. He's improved his game. He uses binoculars any time or place. He needs a close-up, but wants to avoid a chase. Yep. The binoculars are actually integrated to the... Um, to the guns. But you can also... Oh, wait, what? You, you can... Oh, wait, what? Never mind, they're only with the guns. I, for some reason, I thought you could um, use the binoculars alone. I think there was a glitch about that. Anyways, I'll end this episode here. On the next episode, we're going back to Whoville and shoot a lot of houses. Hopefully. And then, so, until then, as always, don't forget to subscribe to subscribe, rate, and comment if you like this episode or not. Jalisco, out.